Yeah, hi. We are from SVS Embedded. The project title name is IoT Based Automated Paralysis Patient Healthcare Monitoring System using GPRS modem. So here we are using 80 Mega 2.60 board and we are using LM35 temperature sensor, ADXL335 fault detection sensor, ECG sensor and we are using 4 flux sensors. Those are connected to the 4 fingers. Flux sensor 1, flux sensor 2, 3, 4. Those are connected with ADC 0, ADC 1, 2, ADC 3, ADC 4, 5, 6, 7. So that's why we are using 80 mega 2.60. So Adreno you know there is no ADC pins up to only 6 pins are available. So we are using total ADC 6 and ADC 7. And it is giving the voice output. AD, APR 33A3 voice recorded and playback IC. And a GPRS modem RX rx3 and tx3 and 16 cross to lc display those are connected with 2 3 4 5 6 7 so we are using one web page so in that web page we are monitoring the temperature data so solution paralysis patient healthcare monitoring system 6 temperature value ecg value and fall detection so we can monitor the temperature data ecg data and fall detection so we will get the sms alert as well as email alert so in our phone we are getting the sms alerts so right fallen back fallen washroom water so let's go to the hardware so here uh, we are using gsm sim 800 l so you can use idea airtel vodafone bsnl 2g 3g 4g sim card sms balance main balance internet balance so this is micro sim card micro sim card we need to insert so B GSM GPRS modem, bridge rectifier, filter capacitor, 7805 regulator and one LED, power supply board, uh, 80 mega 2560, Adreno mega 2560 board, 16 cross to LCD display and LM35 temperature sensor and ECG module and fault detection sensor and voice recorded and playback IC. So we are connecting to body ECG. Okay. So we already loaded the voice to voice module. So now I am going to give the power supply solution for paralytic patient healthcare monitoring system GSM testing connected echo finding network SMS1 SMS2 GPRS main GPRS came HTTP on so iPod text to transfer protocol GPRS is enabled so T for temperature E for ECG X coordinate Y coordinate value and normal fingers ok so now I will go for the temperature alert ok so temperature high temperature alert so we are getting the SMS alert as well as email alert. Okay. Completed. So we can go to site. So the value should be updated here. Yeah. Temperature is updated onto the web page. Okay. So sending the temperature alert to the student mobile numbers. Temperature alert 1 and alert 2. Okay. So now we will go for the fall detection okay right fallen right fallen and send completed action sent okay so here it will update the data yes okay server updated and it is sending the SMS alert to the predefined mobile numbers. Sending GPRS and send completed. So normal fingers. Now I am going to bend one finger. Okay, whenever the voice comes, you can remove. I need water. 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 SMS one, SMS two. Okay, 
so now I'm going for the second finger I need food. I need food. Okay. Two SMS completed. Now I am going for the third finger. So now I am going for the last finger, little finger. I want to go wash I am bending two fingers, one and two. T for temperature, E for ECG, X coordinate, Y coordinate, accelerometer sensor. Then go into the fingers. All the SMS are sending to the mobile numbers. So this is our block diagram. So thanking you.